Good morning, Year 10s. DNA extraction from wheat germ prep from lesson one here for you, in case you weren't able to be in the classroom. So you'll see our aim is to extract and observe the structure of wheat germ DNA. We have a certain collection of materials. We have a beaker of wheat germ, a glass vial, some detergent, popsicle stick, beaker of hot water, and a measuring cylinder. Step one is to take our beaker with one teaspoon of raw wheat germ and to add 20 mils of hot water from the kettle and mix constantly with pop stick for three minutes. So I have a beaker rather than the kettle here. And I'll add this to our beaker of wheat germ. And I'm gonna take a popsicle stick and mix quite vigorously for about three minutes. I won't record for that long though. All right, we have, wait, we have mixed for three minutes, and now we are going to do step three, add one milliliter of detergent using a plastic pipette, filled to just below the bowl. So we're gonna add our detergent now. In it goes. And step four is to mix gently every minute for five minutes. Now this really is a very gentle mix. We're literally going to fold it over and gently move the detergent around. We want to try and create as few bubbles as possible. And now I'm going to leave it for one minute and then do the same again once per minute for five minutes. Okay, so the purpose of mixing the wheat germ seeds with the hot water and mixing around was to break down the outer cell wall of the seeds, of the wheat germ. And then adding the detergent allows the phospholipid bilayer mem cell membrane to be broken down. So now in the solution in front of us, we should have some DNA freely f floating within that solution. It's now time to separate it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're gonna take our beaker here and step six on your prac is to pour just the solution into a glass vial here, filling the vial to about one third height. And that will do. Then what we're going to do is we're going to add some methyl lead spirits. So now we're going to add 10 milliliters of methyl lead spirits from an automatic dispenser. So I'm gonna hold the vial up underneath the dispenser here at an angle so that the alcohol can run down the side of the vial and hopefully we will get some DNA precipitated at the boundary layer between the solution and the methyl spirits. And you can see a little bit just there, that kind of milky, filmy sort of layer, that is our wheat germ DNA precipitated. We can then come across and have a little bit of a play with that DNA, we can actually sort of mix it around, lift up little strands of it, and you can sort of see it's that kind of slightly gooey, filmy kind of consistency. So that's the extraction of DNA from wheat germ crack. In your prac, in your prac booklet or in your, in your notes, if you want at home at the moment, you can write down some observations of what you saw me do at each of the steps. And then there are some questions that you can fill in, which your teacher can provide you on Canvas, um, or you can just pause this and write individually.